Yesterday we got an unexpected surprise. Our neighbor, uh, back neighbor, was moving the chicken coop that used to be right here over there. And to get it from here to over there, he wanted to cut down and pollard his curly willow vine or curly willow tree. So I told him I'd be happy to take it. And um, cause he had already given me ones from a different one he had trimmed. And um, <clears throat> it's just starting to bud out. Perfect timing of year for me to take some of these. And um, you're probably thinking, what the heck is she gonna do with all this? Most of it is for the rabbits. The rabbits love this. They will just eat this all down. Um, so we're gonna let a lot of it dry over here. And pardon the mess. I was in the middle of cleaning yesterday when it all happened. Here's some of the stuff I'm gonna take over to the rabbits for right now, but I've been digging these in. So I'm gonna root these in just a bag of dirt um, that I had sitting around from when I was digging a hole the other day. So let's get some water in this. Hold on just a second. All right, so I'm going to soak this through a full few times. This is basically, this is just natural soil and my really dirty, painty hands. Um, so I'm gonna let this soak through and then I'll come back and I'll water it again and again and again and again until I know that all the water is coming through the bottom. And I'll probably mulch the top, uh, but I'm gonna have to water this a lot because it's a fabric pot. Uh, it's just what I have right now. So I'm gonna use this. Hopefully these should root pretty quick. And then I should be able to put some around for shade over in the rabbit area. And I'll just need to um, make sure that these guys are protected at the bottom so the rabbits don't destroy the bark and just keep the plants from growing. But I can make some, some uh, hedgerows with this as long as I keep them small. And then that way the roots shouldn't get out of control. So hold on and I will show you what I'm doing in the rabbit area with them. We're gonna grab these. So let's go over and do that. And I've got an order that just showed up. My tracking just showed me. I got a couple of these and I think these are different versions of a curly willow. This one's like golden. And that one's like green. So these were two different trees he gave me. So I'm gonna check and see if there's a difference between like, or maybe just this one wasn't getting as much sun, but it's like gold. So I don't know. Let me go over here. I've been doing some work on the chicken run. Something missing over here. Guys, you know what? A couple of these. Hold on. There. So the babies are gonna get some. This one, Mama, who I have over here by herself, is gonna get one. There you go, darling. Enjoy that. And then these guys already have a bunch. Hey, Merlin, what she's doing? You got your hide? Yes. Merlin's favorite chew toys. So basically, the first batch of branches he gave me was not as anywhere near as much. It was from that greener looking tree. So that's one chunk that he gave me. And this is that. So they really do a good job of debarking stuff. And then here's the the big old branch I gave them yesterday. So what I'm gonna wanna do is now that, cause this is so big and everything that's touching the ground, they already pretty much got, so. Okay, baby, don't get poked. All right. You okay? Like, yes. Okay. So now this is slightly flipped and they're already coming back over. 
like, okay. She gave us easier spots to get. So they've already stripped all of this. So I've got plenty of willow now for them and hopefully I will be able to put a couple in here and just keep them really well trimmed and pollarded. Maybe one over here. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We are definitely running out of room, but that's always been the case. <laughs> we always end up finding more room somewhere. Don't we, Sammy? All right, so this is the start of the willow in our rabbit run. I'm thinking maybe I'll put one over there in that corner there. And I'm thinking possibly over here. I do have a tree I want to put here, so it just depends on what shows up. Eventually, I want this whole thing shaded during the summer. Um, so the rabbits don't have any like major direct sun except for the canopy because it gets really warm in here and the shade helps a ton. So, and eventually these are going to go back into the compost. I'll just break them down once they've been completely dried out because we wouldn't want these to root, but they're mostly dry already because all of that bark has been taken off. It's kind of nuts, but you can really see like you know, how much they dry these out. You can just hear it. So. Alright. Well. We'll go ahead and get some of these other trees I just got a notification on. That are here. And I'm going to start working on them. Expect another video here soon. And we will update on the willow later. You guys stay safe. Stay healthy, and we'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye.